We're back in Undertale. Let's do it. Uh, last episode, we made good friends with Papyrus and Sans, and I believe we were told to watch out for these flowers here. Uh, the Echo Flowers. And uh, that's where we're at. We're leaving Snowden. Let's do it. This is a box. You can put an item or take an item out. Why would you, though? You can't use items when they're in the box. Very true. Sincerely, a box hater. I mean, I have to agree with the box hater. Ooh. Are we going to try to... Let's go down first. Down seems like the easier way to go. Hmm. We can go even, even further down. Talk to this flower here. I swore I saw something behind that rushing water. Well, we'll check... Whoa, whoa! Behind the rushing water, huh? Oh, they lied to us. Oh, no, they didn't. There's a tutu lying on the ground here. Will you take it? Let's take the tutu. You got the old tutu. I bet this is a piece of armor. Oh, we didn't equip our manly bandana. Let's equip all this stuff here. Um, let's get the info on it here. Armor of 10. Yeah, we're, we're definitely going to wear that. Equip that. Old Tutu is the armor. I don't see the manly bandana anywhere, but... Oh, that was probably the... Uh, what we had on before we put the Tutu on. Now, if I put this tough glove on, do I lose the tutu? I do not. Oh, I lose the snow knife. Or the toy knife. The snow knife. And so the glove was five attack, I believe. Do these actually do anything? I don't... They don't appear to do anything. Almost got hit there. I like the shadow. It's being cast on her face. Uh oh. Huh. Hi, Undyne. I'm here with my daily report. Uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier. Huh? Did I fight them? Y yes, of course I did. I fought them valiantly. What? Did I capture them? Well, 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 well no. I tried very hard on Dine, but in the end, I failed. Well, well what? You're going to take human soul, the human soul yourself, but on Dine, you don't have to destroy them. You see, you see... The papyrus is standing up for us here. I understand. I'll help you in any way I can. Perhaps not. Oh, we've been spotted. He's going to throw a spear at us. Uh, maybe. We thought about it anyway. Mm, that was strange. Alright. <laughs> Yo, did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome. I'm so jealous. What did you do to get her attention? Ha ha. Come on. Let's go watch her beat up some bad guys. Um, oh, careful. I think I'm the bad guy here. A feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. When four bridge seeds align in the water, they will sprout. How do I... Oh, I just... There we go. Pick up these uh, sprouts and perfect. Okay. We're being attacked by Aaron. <laughs> it's Aaron, guys. Press C. Shoo, I'm sweating. I, I pressed the button. 
I press the button? It smells like a muscle farm. Oh, I see. I have to hit. I have to hit the button twice. Whoa! Oof. Aaron is sweating bolts. Oh, do we have to repeatedly tap Z, maybe? Come on in, the water's fine. Ugh. Aaron is splashing you playfully. Yeah, we have to keep... You have to tap it repeatedly there. Chew, I'm sweating. Oof. We're getting better at that. Oh, uh, looks like we can spare Aaron. We'll spare Aaron. Why not? Zero XP and 19 gold. I really want to read the sign here, but... Let's, uh, let's read the sign. Uh, <laughs> place that correctly. We can't place it that way. There we go. That's what we wanted to do. Although I think all four, four of them have to be in a row to create a bridge, right? If an error is made, the Bell Blossom can call bridge seeds back to where they started. Let's, let's hit the bell here. Um... See, I think we do want to put all four there. It's just so we can read the sign. Which probably doesn't say anything, right? Let's see. Congratulations, you failed the puzzle. Yeah. <laughs> I kind of figured that was the case. Um, now here's the interesting part. There's not four... It's definitely not four wide. So I think we need to send them north here and create... I'll show you what I mean. It's going to be the second one over. And we're going to send it that way. See what I'm doing? Not a difficult puzzle. Well, I'm still not sure what those mushrooms do. There we go. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. How did I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number sequentially until I got yours. <laughs> so, what are you wearing? I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing a dusty tutu. Yeah, that's that's us. Is that true? Are you wearing a dusty tutu? What will you say? Yeah, I am. So you are wearing a dusty tutu. Got it. Wink, wink. Have a nice day. Hopefully Papyrus is trying to set up some diversion to help us sneak by um, Undyne. A long time ago, monsters would whisper their wishes to the stars in the sky. If you hoped with all your heart, your wish would come true. Now we have are these sparkling stones on the ceiling. In the wishing room. Thousands of people wishing together can't be wrong. The king will prove that. Wush, Wushua shuffles up. Wushua. Well, that does quite a bit of damage. Your soul is unclean. Oh! oh I see we have to kind of stay on the outside of that one there. Uh, let's go ahead and spare Wushua. Come on, sis. Make a wish. I wish my sister and I will see the real star someday. Can we use this telescope? Let's take a look. Oh, check wall. Check wall, they say. Um, I wonder which wall. Uh, sees my... Oh, sees my horoscope is the same as last week's. Check wall. Maybe this wall up here? Yeah. Yep. 
Ancient writing covers the walls. You can you can just make out the words. The War of Humans and Monsters. Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seemed that they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. It would take the soul of nearly every monster. Just equal the power of a single human soul. But humans have one weakness. Ironically, it's the strength of their soul. Its power allows them to persist outside the human body even after death. Hmm. If a monster defeats a human, they can take its soul. A monster with a human soul, a horrible beast with unfathomable, po unfathomable power. It's an illustration of a strange creature. There's something very unsettling about this drawing. So you can kind of see why the monsters want... Oh, I thought this was a place where you go. Want the uh, human soul. Or a little raft here. Hello? Well, looks like Undyne found us. As long as we dodge, I think we're okay. Oh, we got hit. Whoa! Well, let's avoid getting hit again. Oh, we got hit again. Ah! She's still following us? We need to heal badly. Can we heal? Oof. Did we lose her? Uh... <laughs> Beautiful. Let's heal one. Uh, actually, let's see if we can find it. I bet there's a save point coming up. Appreciate the help there, friend. Yo, did you see that? Undyne just touched me. I'm never washing my face again. Man, are you unlucky. You were standing just a little bit to the left. Yo, don't worry. I'm sure we'll see her again. You gotta just be careful there. piece of cheese has been here so long, a magical crystal has grown around it. It's stuck to the table. That mouse still isn't coming out. Squeak. Knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the mystical crystal, it fills you with determination. Okay. Dr. Sands here. I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. It's normally 50,000 gold to use this premium telescope, but... Since I know you, you can use it for free. How about it? Absolutely. Let's see what's out there. A lot of red. Well, there might be nothing out here. Huh? You aren't satisfied? Don't worry. I'll give you a full refund. Wow. It's an odd-looking telescope. Maybe the telescope doesn't actually work. Uh, no. Don't you use the box? Oh, let's get some ice cream over here, I suppose. I relocated my store, but there are still no customers. Fortunately, I thought of a solution. Punch cards. Every time you buy an ice cream, a nice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can trade them for a free ice cream. They're sure to get customers to come back. An ice cream. It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Uh, we have six out of eight space. 25 gold? Absolutely. Your card is in the box. You got the ice cream. Is in this box here. Take a card. Uh, yeah. There's ancient, the, oh, the ancient glyphs have been painted over with a list of 21 different flavors. No. That might not have been a, the right thing to do there. Nice cream, man. Who are you? What a star. Well, what's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? These are all good questions. Uh, let's go to the right here first. Hello, duck. I 
guess we'll just uh, try to get over to the dock then. You're a passing conversation. So don't you have any wishes to make? You're a passing conversation. Hmm. Just one. But it's kind of stupid. Just eave eavesdrop on people's old conversations, I guess. Now, I thought both... Yeah, both of these can be spared here. Zero XP, zero gold. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? You're carrying too much. Oh, I'm carrying too much? Let's, um... I mean, I eat the candy, I guess. Just so we could pick up the ballet shoes. I didn't realize we were our inventory was full. Let's check the info. Uh, weapon attack seven. These shoes make you feel incredibly dangerous. You equip the ballet shoes, so that means the glove went back in our inventory. Yeah. Um, okay. I have no idea what all those mushrooms do. And we may never know, either. Ring, it's Papyrus, yep. Hello, this is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about, asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know, her opinion of you is very murdery. But I bet you knew that already, and because you knew that, I told her what you told me you were wearing. Hmm. A dusty tutu, because I knew, of course, after such a suspicious question, you would obviously change your clothes. You're such a smart cookie this way. You're safe, and I didn't lie. No betrayal anywhere. Being friends with everyone is easy. Oh, I see. So maybe we could have avoided that com confrontation with Undyne there. Oh, that was an interesting way to do it. Fifty-two XP and twenty-five gold. You hear a passing conversation. Don't say that. Come on. I promise I won't laugh. It's a little bit of a maze we're in here. Not too bad, though. The power to take their souls. This is the power that humans feared. Hello? What is... What are you? Uh-oh. Well, this can't be good. Oh, they look friendly. Hey there. Notice you were here. I'm Onion San. Onion San, you hear? Okay, we'll be on our way. Uh, you're visiting the waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too. It's my big favorite. Okay. Even though the water's getting so shallow here, I have to sit down all the time. But, hey, that's okay. Beats moving to the city. And living in a crowded aquarium, like all my friends did. Yeah, that's true. And the aquarium's full. Uh, anyway, so even if I wanted to, I that's okay, though, you hear? Undyne's going to fix everything, you hear? I'm going to get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? I hope that works out for you. Hey there, that's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. In Waterfall... Hmm. Oh, they seem nice. Shiren hides in the corner, but somehow encounters you anyway. We did quite a bit of damage there. Hum hum. Well, that was easy to dodge. Uh, Shiren's voice gets raspy. Eh, we'll spare her. Might as well spare one we can. The northern room hides a great treasure. Well, let's go check it out. There's a piano here. Play it. Hmm. 
Did I do that right? X to quit. Hmm. Well, I assume you got to follow the pattern on the wall there, but... A haunting song exo echoes down the cor corridor once you play along. Only the first eight are fine. Only the first eight are fine. Did I do that right? I think I did. Uh. No, we didn't do that correct. Um, let's try. That was the first eight. No. Uh, one more try. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Well, it didn't seem to work either. Haunting song echoes down the corridor. Won't you play along? Only the first eight are fine. Hmm. Let's try. Hmm. Well, I don't think that's correct either. I'm a little bit confused here. Let's try... Hmm. Well, I'm not sure, guys. I did try, though. The northern room hides a great treasure. The first eight are okay. This power has no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. And an incredible power would, needed, would be needed to, to take the soul of a living monster. There is only one exception. The soul of a special species of monster called a boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death. Only for a few moments. A human could absorb this soul. But this has never happened. And now it never will. Hello? It's a statue. The structures at its feet seem dry. It's an interesting looking statue. Please take one. Oh, we get a, oh I bet we'll... Let's take an umbrella to the uh, statue. Uh, inside the statue, music begins to play. The music continues and doesn't stop. I wonder if that music has anything to do with... It probably doesn't. I'm... Am I going to try this one more time? I think I am. No, I don't. I have no idea, guys. If you know, um, let me know in the comments. I'll probably look it up um, at some point, I guess. It's probably this tune we have to play.
Oh, there it is at the top there. So up, right, down, down, right. 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 Hey, we did it. I bet everyone thought I wasn't going to get that. Uh, it's a legendary artifact. We take it? Let's take it. You're caring too much. Oh. Uh, what do we want to get rid of? Let's get rid of... I guess let's drop the Tough Glove. We need to probably start using our uh, storage box. You're carrying too many dogs. I have too many dogs? What is this? Annoying dog, dog, a little white dog. It's fast and asleep. Well, I don't remember picking this up. You deployed the dog. The dog absorbs the artifact. Oh, no! What was... <laughs> what was that? Oh. The artifact is gone. Oh. Well, that was, um... Well, that was disappointing. Gotta be honest, I did not expect that. Can we take another umbrella? Do we just get to carry this umbrella for the rest of the game? It'd be kind of neat. Oh, we can give them an umbrella. Ah, oh, they can walk with us. Yeah, let's go. Uh, you're lagging behind a little bit. Oh, that's alright. Man, Undyne is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I'd wet the bed every night, knowing she was going to beat me up. Ha ha. They're not uh, very perceptive, are they? I do enjoy a walk in the rain. So one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking, yo, how cool would it be if Undyne came to school? She could beat up all the teachers. I mean, that doesn't sound very cool. Uh, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. Well, I'm innocent, though. Oh, there's the castle. Do we need to do anything? Hello? Should we call somebody? Let's call Papyrus. Ring, ring. That's the king's castle. Let's call Toriel. But nobody can. Oh, I thought I saw our head peek poke up there. Oh, there we are. I guess we're just walking to the castle now. Should we uh, deposit our umbrella? Eh, let's put it back. Yo, this ledge is way too steep. You want to see Undyne, right? Climb on my shoulders. Well, I appreciate the help. Uh, guess we have to go that way? Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I'll always find a way to get through. <laughs> I suspect they'll probably beat us there, though. The humans, afraid of our power, declared war on us. They attacked suddenly and without mercy. I'll read this one here. In the end, it could. In the end, it could hardly be called a war. United, the humans were too powerful, and us monsters were too weak. Not a single soul was taken, and countless monsters were turned to dust. That's kind of sad. The serene sound of a distant music box. 
that fills you with determination. And we'll save there. And that'll be it for this episode of Undertell. Uh, if you like the video, as always, leave a like. Subscribe to the Unusual Mall for more content. And we will see you next time uh, in Undertale. Goodbye, guys. Thanks for watching.